Hello there everyone and welcome back to Hearts of Iron 4 in which we're using the No Step Back DLC. I'm your host, Mr. Uh, Slavic Union Lover. But right now, as you can tell, we're kind of on the offensive and we're doing pretty darn well. This is not where we left off last time, but it is what it is. We're currently doing Sabotage Polish Industry, so if you like to do that, please go ahead. Um, we've done, uh, of course, local Western plants. I'll be honest, I cannot remember what we've done here in terms of focuses because I've read them so many times before. So if you like to read them, you can always pause the video and read through them. But I will read through the complete plan West. The Polish military high commands are satisfied that adequate plans have been drawn for the inevitable conflict with the Germans and the time for Plan West has come to an end. Also, with the whole uh, local Western plans, you get Slav Slavic Union defensive plans. Apparently, if you open up your decisions tab, you can still do stuff like this. Um, you get defensive plans on territory that is not Polish. I mean, technically, Sudeten might be a little more Czech and Slavic than anything else, but like, still. Uh, 50 pp is quite a bit, but we can still do it all the way down to Vienna. So, that to me doesn't make any sense, but sometimes I'm not going to complain about such things. Actually, Denton, actually, who, over, over here, what the hell is this part of? Ah, uh, lower, lower, uh, Austria. Uh, eh, why not? It, it's, it's a defensive plan. Don't, don't worry that we're on, on the offensive. Yeah, yeah, because totally, Hanover is totally Slavic. Totally Slavic. Or Turingen defensive plan? Totally, totally. I'm going to do a diplomatic mission to Turkey. If we're to convince other nations to join the Intermarium, we must convince them that it is in their best interest. By sending Yosef back on diplomatic missions, we stand a much better chance of building the defensive alliance we dream of. Also, a couple comments, including, like, will I ever play the end of a new beginning again? Yes, I will. Definitely will sometime. Not sure when, but definitely will. Followed up with, uh, yeah, tanks. Uh, 18 combat width is probably better than 20 combat width. 20 combat width is a 20 combat width for divisions are okay now. Not great, but they're just okay. Um, yeah, I don't know. I mean, I'd like to use them, but at this point in the campaign, it's kind of a little late. So since this campaign is not going to last much longer, as you can tell from the title. Um, let's see, a couple of divisions stuck here. Six divisions-ish. Nice. Good stuff. Good stuff. All more factories? Yes, please. Are we missing anything here? Any equipment? No, we're looking actually really good on everything but tactical bombers. Do we even make tactical bombers? Maybe not. Um, make war heavy tanks. I mean... These guys aren't very good since we haven't really focused on them much at all. Basic heavy cannon. Uh, heavy type turret. Man two man turrets, fine enough. Radio, advanced radio, special modules, stabilizer. Get more reliability. Special modules, squeeze bore adaptation. Get more piercing wouldn't be bad, just in case. Well, this armor sucks. Huh. So, we're going to get more armor. And additional machine guns. Anything here? Less reliability? No, thank you. Yeah, actually, ammo storage is just not worth it. We want as much. Reliability as possible. There you go. Use that one too. Riveted armor versus cast armor. Oh, that's so much more armor. So much nicer. Over here, you want to go diesel for more sp that, and then you want to go with even more propulsion bar. Haha, give me raises. Okay, that's not worth it. Um, you can save it for now. You just need more speed on those things. Oh, we have some railway guns too. Very nice. Oh, so we were doing this too, huh? Um, more railway guns. Nothing like a bunch of Polish railway guns to satisfy the military. Because God knows I'm going to be running out of these things anyways. Cool. So, uh, another thing we had to do to get a certain somebody in power is to do the artillery uh, modernization. But if you like to do about standardization equipment, please go ahead. As well as army modernization. But we definitely had to do this one. We must not neglect to improve and modernize the support of our soldiers required for effective deployment. Not bad. Hey, not bad. Not bad. And we sunk five convoys of Lekus and two destroyers. Oh, we lost. Did we lose it? No. Someone else lost them. Might have been the Dominican Republic. Very nice. Some suicide pills are very yummy, yummy. And let's see. Keep doing Germany. Because once Germany collapses, then we rush through Italy. The war's over, pretty much. So. Even though we are struggling down here, too. Um, call, call in Rome again. It's fine. Call me now. These guys will die over there, which is great because they're all cut off. And we hopefully will be ours soon enough. Hopefully. And Germany proper is just. Pretty much dead. Except for like down here near Bavaria, but it is what it is. It is what it is. Plenty enough manpower, plenty enough resources for now. Yeah, the Allies haven't done really too much at all. Casualties, half a million versus 2.6 to the German Reich. And 750,000 to the Italians, so overall not bad. Pretty darn good, I'd say. Oh, did someone call for more railway guns? Okay. Well, they insist. Just nothing. An army. Railway gun only campaign when? Oh, look at that. Nice. More convoy sunk. Very good. Yeah, 
Yeah, a lot of red, but whatever. It is what it is. Oh, we have two, some divisions. Have, there are too many divisions in some of these areas. Uh, there you go. There you go, and there you go. Nice. Wow, we've taken out literally almost all of Germany except for like the rest of the Rhineland. We're all the way in Belgium almost. We literally just took out Luxembourg too. Got a lot of these horses. They're so good. So good. Ah, oh, Switzerland's down here too. Innsbruck. Uh, we can get some more anti air if we really need it though. It's fine. Reform the front line a little bit better than that. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll let the horses deal with the left side here. Um, there you go. Deal with the Swiss territory from that area. Thank you. Another destroyer sunk. Very, very good. Plenty of sub daddies. We love the sub daddies. I'll go into because. We definitely need to get, rush some divisions down to Tuscany or Latium. Then get certain somebody involved, which would be very, very nice. Mm, nothing here too much. No, 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 no. Plenty of army XP, which I already got all these things here. Invitation assault, A. Eh? Thank you. Beautiful. Nothing but railway guns. There goes Hungary. Thank you, Hungary, for playing. Nice. Oh, wow, you're trying to go through Switzerland through this area. Holy crap, that's really <laughs> kind of stupid. But whatever. Whatever. Sabotage plus industry. Very nice. Very nice. Followed up with... Put plan must. Beautiful. Now P42. It's almost 43. And now we're going to do... Air Base Expansion. Oh, let's do some focuses. Ooh, spend Warsaw. I'll do some focuses over here. I'll do Warsaw first just because we can. We haven't done every focus in this part of the focus tree, but, you know, whatever. Oh, well, as soon as I put him over there, he's done. Nice job, guys. Good job. Pat on the backs for you all. Ah, oh, that took a minute. Very nice. There are little blips of people here and there that need to be eliminated, but whatever. Because <sighs> some people always need to be eliminated. Beautiful. Now, that's a nice Slavic Union. Dismantle this group. Dismantle those groups. Do we need anything else here? Some tungsten. Give more tungsten. Yeah, do both these. What are we building up? Roads? Oh, a lot of refineries and cities. Holy crap. So, now we own Tuscany somewhat. Not all the way, but we're getting there. Um, we need Tuscany and or Latium. So, we don't want to rush to capitulate them too hard, too fast. But let's, let's, let's at least get Rome. Because we need to get in bed. Oh, look at this. Wojcik never drops a carrot. Private Wojcik has proved himself a uniquely viable member of our supply lines. Even during the heat of combat, small arms fire brushing their hair on his head. Arms and legs did not drop a single crate of munitions. This brave soldier ensured artillery could keep firing and was thereby instrumental in defeating the enemy. As a result of this, it has been decided that Wojciech should be promoted. Now, may we all take inspiration from his bravery. A corps commander? Can I get rid of you for... Look at this guy. This guy's really good. Oh well. Oh, beautiful. Look at the bear. I wonder if he could become leader for us. I wonder if that's possible. Hmm. Oh, that's not looking good up here, too. Alright, now. Bad. Happy 43, everybody. Early celebrations, I know, but still. Come down here and have a good old time. Let the bear do his deeds. Because the infantry is doing fine enough. I'm not worried about that. Yeah, France can have France. Oh, wow, we're really just sunking a lot of Indonesian convoys here. Some German convoys, a lot of German convoys. Yeah, sub-3s are just where it's at, man. Sub-3s and 4s are just so ridiculously strong. We have the bear. We have the bear. He's learning. There's a cavalry leader. He can charge in with the enemies. Ljubljana. Ah, thank you. Oh, we won. Very nice. Very, 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 very nice. Uh, free France, you don't get anything here just because you don't really deserve anything. Maybe except for the, uh, let's see, the UK. Do they deserve anything? You know what? We don't want to deal with Africa. Who likes Africa? Except for the resources. The Chinese do. But, here, you can have all that stuff. We don't care about that stuff. Mm, rifle Polish territory. All these states are rightful territory for us. Absolutely. 
And when we doubt, when in doubt, rack it up. Oh wait, I give him that. Uh, we took. Oh, Iraq. Hello. We're in a war. The fall of Hong Kong. Well, that's nice. A significant development. Well, all right. Well, people want to do all that stuff. That's fine with us. We're looking pretty good. It looks kind of ugly with the way this is. Oh my God, that's so ugly. Uh, you're our puppet, right? So we could probably just like do a whole bunch of this stuff and then uh, just annex you probably that way. That'd probably be best. And you have a lot of oh. Here, just suppress them. Uh, can we go to war with anybody else? Estonia. We can go to war with Belarus. But they're already guaranteed by the Allies, which kind of sucks. I don't want to fight the Allies, to be honest. Um, but a couple other focuses. Oh, the fate of Anastasia Romanov. Following the capture of Moscow by the Slavic Union and their allies, their operatives found notes from the NKVD archives revealing the gruesome fate of the Romanov family. The report concludes that the entire imperial family, including Anastasia, was executed in July of 1918 by the Bolsheviks. If it all act quickly, the world would no soon know our queen's not who she pretends to be. So when else shall bear the crown of Poland? Bear the evidence the world shall never know. Hmm, he who bears the throne. Hey! We got one check. Wait, is he supposed to have two more modifiers here? I think he might supposed to because there's two lines there. So stability, war sport, ideology, drift defense. So, um, that's really what I want to do for this entire campaign. I just want the bear. Actually, I might just make a quick guide on how to do it really easily. So, um, yeah, I think that's going to be it for us. That's all I really wanted. I wanted the bear. Uh, I'll a couple focuses for this campaign. Um, if you want to read these, please go right ahead. You know, expand Lithuanian shipyards. It's okay. Uh, Polish with the winning railways. We well, can't do this one, but you can read it anyway if you want. Push through Ruthenia. Merge these arms industries. Warsaw to Crimea. And then merge the civilian industries. But hey, quite a short video. But hey, if you enjoyed the video, please do consider leaving a like for me. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I guess I'll see you tomorrow in another video. Thanks for watching. Have a great, 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 great Slavic Wojciech. Rest of your day.